For me and my, and my students, I have absolutely no problem telling them they need to back down. Or if they come to me and feel that they're over face, I have no problem saying, that's fine, go ahead and go back down to, the, to, to a lower level. It's one of the things we talked about in the course design and things um, is, is, is coming up with courses that are really appropriate for moving up. I think that's one of the key elements. Um, you know, it may be appropriate to move up at this event, but in the next one that's in your, your, your line of what you're going to do, maybe that's not an appropriate course for your second preliminary. So then maybe you do training there. And you, you, for me, I really try to pick and choose for my students what are appropriate um, events to move up, move up. And same with my horses. I, I pick and choose where, where they're going to go. Just because you go preliminary doesn't mean you are now going preliminary. So, so for me, I try to be very flexible with my horses as well as with my students about what are appropriate events to be, to be attending. <laughs> I was going to say, I, th I think you, you'd notice, especially for those of you like, like us that, that start the year quite early um, in January, uh, February, in different parts of the world, um, I think you'll notice that uh, all of us up here would, would actually take our own horses, even upper level of horses, and start them out one level down. And it, it's a good way to get your season started. I think a lot of times people say, well, now I'm preliminary, and I see a lot of problems early on in the year where people are, we're all rusty, you know? And so I think th there's never a time where it's bad to come down and, and work your way back up. If there's a confidence issue, sometimes somebody's had a fall <coughs> or a horse has developed maybe a little bit of an issue with a certain type of fence, and you have to come back to sort of work through that. But even at the beginning of the year, horses that have no problems, so to speak, uh, it's, it's a good confidence booster even for advanced horses to run intermediate or intermediate horses to take a preliminary or two to, to get them back in the flow. There's no shame in that at all. And, yeah, and I, I, I echo that, and especially it, it's true even if the horse and rider aren't having an issue. I'll tell you a quick story. Um, when I took Teddy to Lexington, and he was very successful there, and then he went on to make the Pan Am team. Uh, he, I, his last event that I ran him in before the Pan American Games was a preliminary horse trial. Uh, and it's because I, he was very confident, but I wanted to make sure when he got down there to the Pan American Games, I could really um, have that ultra confidence in him uh, by not kind of pushing the button of the four star over and over and over again. Because we're all about showing horses what they can do and not proving to them what they can't do. I think in, in oh, you, you want to go? I just, um, I think every, you know, there's not going to be one answer for a question like that, but I mean, it, it's important to recognize um, if you've moved up to preliminary and it hasn't gone well, it's important to realize or work out why, um, what the problem is, and a lot of the time it might be better to address that problem, miss an event or two, save your money on the entry and get some help or whatever, because I mean, just dropping down to dropping back to training level might not fix what you know. If your horse, horse or you have a bit of a chink in your armor, you know, you probably need to work out what that is before you go back to preliminary level. And being at training level might not necessarily fix that either. You know, so because so. corner corner issue or something like that, you're not gonna you're not gonna have corner corners on the training typically. I mean, at least not to that degree, not 45 degree angle corners or whatever. So dropping down may not solve the problem. So you have to, to know what it is. But certainly a good, a good run never hurts. <laughs>